There are different levels of a generative thematics. They can be international, they can be global, they can be national, and they can be regional and very specific sub-thematics within a given culture. And that if we are going to create a pedagogy that does not rely on top-down model, we have to understand the general thematics in which we are working, but also the specific sub-thematics within which people exist. Right? Only then can we develop a mode of problem-posing education which actually knows the lived or living conditions of the people with whom we are working. That's absolutely crucial in a kind of pedagogy which is trying to challenge what he calls the epochal thematics, that of domination, right, against which he's offering us the pedagogy of the oppressed, the pedagogy of liberation, because the fight, remember, is to make sure that humanization is possible to all of us, right? So that's really important to keep in mind as he discusses this. Then there is another point that he's making, which is about the understanding of a specific thematics. What he's arguing is that most of the time people who live in a given generative thematics may not be aware of it. They, must, they may only be aware of its effects. We are poor. Our lives are not good. We don't have food, right? Those are the things that we feel on the level of the body, you know, the epiphenomena of a thematic at work, right? The question is, that unless we understand what causes poverty, what causes insecurity, what causes general illness, what causes exploitation, we cannot then develop a mode of liberatory pedagogy. That is why what he's telling us is that these generative thematics, they, they are like concentric circles, the larger thematics within that, it enables smaller them thematics. And then depending on the region, the people you're interacting with will have different kinds of sub-generative thematics that constitute human identities, but that cannot just be understood simply by focusing on the effects. And part of problem-posing education is to learn, along with the people we are trying to teach, as to what kind of thematics are they caught in, who is generating it, who is perpetuating it, and then how to develop collectively a method to dismantle that.